Yo, what is going on guys? It is Glake here. All right, so today I am doing a Pokemon uh, trading card game online, Guardians Rising booster pack opening. Yes, I usually do these on my Twitch channel, not gonna lie. But today I figured, you know what? I kinda wanna do something a little bit different. I wanna just make one exclusive for YouTube just because I've opened so many of these like on stream already, like literally. Let me tell you guys something about Pokemon trading card game online, all right? This game for like the past, I don't even know, like the past, past month and a half or so, like this has pretty much been all I've been playing on stream, which is really bad. Like this game, I've been pretty much averaging playing this game and nothing else. I mean, I've streamed like maybe one or two games throughout the week, but for the most part, for up throughout the past several months, it has pretty much just been this game. Um, and I've been opening a lot of packs on stream. And I did say the last time I streamed this game, I did say that that was it for big pack openings on the stream until... Uh, the next expansion comes out which i think is like burning shadows or something like that and that's not till like august so i mean but then again i got some more packs and i was like all right <laughs> i i gotta do something different this time around so i figured you know what let's just do it let's just do it for youtube so that's what i'm doing today and um yo let's go to the collection real quick um as you can see we got 60 packs we're gonna be freaking opening it's about to get lit now i don't know i, I can't get as crazy as you know i do on stream when i do these just because you know the stream hype isn't exactly there which is why i really prefer opening these on stream to be very honest but i wanted to make one exclusive to youtube because i used to do pack openings of, for hearthstone on youtube like as well back when i used to play it but first this is a stream tradition we've got we got to pull up the stats we got to make a stat list of what we pull because let me tell y'all something let me let me tell y'all another stream tidbit so in this game for some reason I tend to have like stupid freaking luck when it comes to ultra rare pulls like I get stupid luck now the past few openings that I've done mm, haven't really been that lucky but I mean I would be getting like freaking 15 to 20 ultra rares in like 50 or less packs I think I've, I think I even pulled like what like 12 or like 17 or something out of a 36 pack or something before it's just absolutely absurd so I mean I, I get really good luck in this game the last few openings it's been kind of average for the most part um but overall i feel like i get some really good luck and because of that we usually keep track of you know what i pull um and my final results and stuff like that on stream i kind of just we kind of just keep track as we go so i'm gonna set up that now so we got ultra rares we've got full arts we don't track the regular arts it's like no part point actually now let's let's track the regular arts it's fine it's fine and we've got the secret rares. All right. So there's really, there is really nothing else. <laughs> there's really nothing else to do here, but to jump right into this. Oh, excuse me. So let's, so let's freaking do it. I'm basically doing this as if I'm live streaming. Like I really am. I got my cup of tea right here, even though this is not like the iced tea that's usually present on stream, but is still team man i don't know what else to tell you all right so let's go ahead with this first pack let's not waste any time let's get this going let's get this going oh boy who who the nervous the nervous sea is here oh man oh god what are we gonna get what are we gonna get now as you guys can probably tell i'm still like really tired while i'm doing this like my my eyes are still tired i woke up probably like i don't know maybe an hour and a half ago so yo your boy's still kind of tired all right all right Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my god. A full art mallow. A full art mallow bet. And no, I'm not gonna lie, that is actually my second one. Um I actually pulled one. I think I pulled one on stream. So this is my second full art mallow. Um yo, we start out with full arts right away? Right away? It's too soon. It's too soon for full arts. Okay, so we got one full art already. So that job that down. I guess that technically counts as an ultra rare. So so far we're at one ultra rare, one full art. Now, yo man, I don't I don't I don't really know like what else to say. I mean, hang on, I gotta la I gotta label this file real quick. There we go. Send it to my desktop so I don't lose it. To the desktop. Okay, okay, okay. It's too early for full arts. Now I I know full art Mallow doesn't really go for that much, so you know it's it's kind of whatever. But she is like one of my favorite trainer cards just because Mallow is the true thing. Mal's the truth then. All right, all right. Next, next pack, next pack. Okay, so we're already off to a really good start. A fuller on pack one, I'm feeling it. It could have been a Pokemon. That would have been a little bit more lit, but you know what? 
you know what i'm feeling it i'm feeling it i like now i tend to start getting luck at the beginning if i get luck at the beginning it's not a good sign because it's like all my luck wears off and then it's nothing but dry towards the ending but we about to see what this is we about to see we about to see okay we got a pangoro pangoro trash card don't want to see it ever again stay out of my life pangoro chancy can ever oh this is this chancy i don't have this is one that i don't have i hope i get more of these because i'm actually running like a chancy a chancy deck like it's like chancy slash sylveon it's really bad but i'm using the other chancy that does 80 damage to itself this one just does straight up 80 for four it's the same amount same damage so i should probably swap that one it's just 10 less health <laughs> and actually flip a coin if heads heal 30 damage for one of your yo i have to go with this one i have to go with this one i hope i pull more of these i didn't even realize this was in the set i hope i pull more of those all right next pack next freaking pack all right no double no double the funds yet no double the funds yet but just stuff that i already have so that's all good it's all good all right what do we got what do we got okay lilligant all right i've already gotten several of those nothing really nothing nothing to see there same old same old <sighs> All right, let's see here. Okay, another Mallow. Is this going to mean I'm going to get a full art Mallow again? Is it possible? Is it possible? Can we get a full art something? Oh! That is my third Sylveon. Let's freaking go. Freaking Sylveon. Regular art. It's all good. It's all good. So we got one regular art up in here. I don't even know if I should keep track of regular arts, to be, to be honest. Eh, I guess I will. I guess I will since I already started. So we're up to two ultra rares already. Mm, it's looking crisp. Sylveon. Oh, I love Sylveon. Sylveon is like... I think Sylveon's like one of my top favorite, top five favorite Pokemon now. I think. I think. I'll have to go through the Pokemon list. Like, Raichu will always be number one, though. Always. Can't complain about a full art Sylveon. I'll tell you that much. Whew. Okay, so far, so good. Ooh, a double the fun. A double the fun. This is our first double the fun. Our first. This is our feist. Our feist double the fun. Okay, what do we got? Give me something good. Don't disappoint me, please. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I don't want to see this card anymore. I'm never going to use this thing. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh. Sharpedo. Gross. 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 Now, it'd be really cool if I can get a secret rare double colorless. Like, I just really want one in real because they're worth like 77 bucks or something like that in real. Like, they're worth a decent amount of money, but it'd be kind of lit if we got one in game. I got a secret rare, uh, rare candy already, but unfortunately I got that. Did I get that from, oh no, no, no. I got a secret rare enhanced hammer and a secret rare, rare candy. The rare candy though came from store-bought packs, so I can't freaking sell it. So, or not sell it, but uh, I can't trade it off, which sucks. Like every single time I get something from the store, I always get something really good that I can't trade and it just kind of irritates me. Oct Oricorio. This is the one that I like. The Feather Dance one that I like. The electric one. Alright, so I can't really complain about that. I think that might be my, my third or fourth one. Not really sure. We got Mudbray. More choice bands. Alright. What do we got here? Come on, man. Come on. Big money. Big money. A Pangoro. <sighs> Every single time I see this thing, I cry. I cry. Four for 130. I cry. 130 health only? Oh my god, I cry. Nintendo, Pokemon Company. Why do you guys do this? Why do you guys make cards like this? I want to know. I want to know. Alright, so we got a Jangmo. Jango Mo, oh, whatever it's called. And we got uh, Vanillax. Man, really? Really? Okay. It's, it's kind of getting dry. It's kind of getting dry. We're getting a little dry. <sighs> a little dry. Ooh, double the fun. Not dry. Not that dry. Not that dry. Ooh, Mimikyu. Okay, this is my... I want to say this is my third one. I want to say it's my third one. Copycat, still pretty good. But that, that, uh, that filch. That is, that is what you go for. Oh my god. Such a good move. Such a good move. And a Lilligant. Okay. Man, I prefer if it was Garbodor or Trevenant in that, in that slot. Even though I have, like, so many already. I think I traded some off, but still, it'd be nice to get more. Just trade them for more packs, basically. Another double the fun. <gasps> Another Mimikyu. Oh my god, this thing is all over the place. It's all over the place. And... Oh. My third Chapo Coco. 
This is my <coughs> this is my third type of cocoa, no lie. And uh, this is a regular art. It's my third regular art. So we are up to two regular arts and three ultra rare. So far, so good. All right, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Another Tapu Coco. I can't really complain about that. Yes, I would. I think people would just prefer Tapu Lele at this point. But uh, I can rock with three. Three is nice because uh, two, I wasn't really feeling it. And I think I had two left on my list. No, I took Tapu Coco off because I said three. I said two was enough. So I took one off my list. Originally, I had three, I think. All right, another double of fun. Let's go with this one this time around. Should we or is it too early? It's too early. It's too early. Let's, let's go in a row. Let's just go in a row. Oh, um, a minor, minor, however you want to pronounce it. And Pokemon is knocked down. Oh, yeah, that's right. And not a pa Pangoro, you want to leave? Can you please leave? Oh, my God. This thing is all up in my freaking packs. Like, leave. Remove yourself from the set, please. Cast form, nose pass, same on, same on. And we got a lowing golem. I don't think I've gotten this before. I think this is actually my first one. Heavy slam. This attack does 30 less damage for each colorless in your opponent's active Pokemon's retreat cost. Huh. 30 less damage. <laughs> but it initially does 200 <laughs> which ain't that bad i ain't gonna complain about that hmm. i don't know how i feel about that 30 less for each one so i mean if you can evolve this early and like you could just snipe off like weaker pokemon like literally because they usually don't have that high of retreat cost so you can do at least Yo, I don't know, like you could do at least like maybe 130. It's really not that bad. Uh, flip a coin for each electric energy attached to this Pokemon. This attack does 80 damage for each head. Whoa, 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 what? Okay. I hope I get some more of these actually. Maybe two more. That'd be nice. All right. Next pack. 47 left. Whew. Oh man, it's too early for me to be doing this. It is too early. It is too early. All right, what do we got here? Well, Rayquaza. All right, I've already got so many of those. Attach two basic energy cards from your discard pile to one of your bench Pokemon. That is pretty good. Now I see why people are running this and why people want this. Also, it's a basic, which is not bad because you can attach, uh, not choice band. You can attach um, uh, the belt to it. You can attach a lot of stuff to this thing. And, oh, <laughs> Yes, yes, another freaking full art Turtonator. This is the full art, right? Yes, it is. I I have one Turtonator, and it is a full art, just like this one. Wow, I'm so glad I am not getting regular art Turtonators. We are at two full arts, right? Yes, and four ultra rares overall. Thank God, another Turtonator. I am so happy. Oh, I'm getting the stuff that I want. <laughs> I'm actually getting the stuff that I want. What else is on my list? Let me check here. Yeah, so Turtonator. I, I had times two on my list, so it'd be nice if I get one more. I got that one more Tapu Coco, and I just need two more Tapu Leles, and we're good. And we are golden for this set. Like, that's legit it. I still have a chance to maybe draw some Tapu Leles, but I guess we'll see what happens. Tapu Lele is literally, like, the hardest thing to get. Like, you just don't get it. It's, like, straight up impossible, but we will continue our luck. All right. <sighs> Let's keep it going, man. Let's keep it going. All right. No double the fun this time around. Well, and Geo, dude, and a Probo Pass, which is probably trash, which it is. All right. Let's keep it. Keep it moving. Halo. Uh oh. Double the fun. You know what time it is. You know what time it is. Oh, Mudsdale. Oh boy. What do we got here? What do we have here? The victory bell, bro. Victory bell, really? <sighs> victory bell makes me cry. I'm not even gonna lie. That Pokemon just straight up makes me want to shed tears. That thing is worse than Pangoro. I hate seeing that thing. I hate victory bell as a Pokemon. I, I used to think that it looked cool. Not anymore, man. Not anymore. All right, another goth. Another goth. Keep the goths out. 
I never got to fully read Link Blast. If this Pokemon near your opponent's active Pokemon have the same amount of energy attached to them, attack does 80 more damage. Oh, okay, so that's really not that bad, I guess. I guess, yeah, that's not that bad. Switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. This attack does 30 damage to the new active. Oh, okay. Cool. I actually didn't know about that, but it's two-stage evolution. I freaking hate that crap. Yeah, it is two-stage. Ugh. If, it, if only it was just one, then I'd be fine with that card, but considering the fact that it's two, it irritates me, man. It just irritates me. Oh, well. Rare candy, boys. Another victory bell. Ugh. Ugh. It's getting gross. It's getting gross. We're getting slapped for that, uh, for that Turtonator. We are... <laughs> Uh, the game is the game is showing us who's boss ever since that Turtonator. And uh, what do we got here? Uh, Drampa. You know, it'd be nice to get another Drampa GX. I'm not gonna lie. Gramps. Move an energy from this Pokemon to one of your bench Pokemon. I have several of the basic one though, so not really something that I need more of. Not gonna lie. All right, Bell Sprout. Another rescue stretcher. I, I traded a lot of those actually the other day. And uh, it's nice to get some more, I guess. And a Trevenant. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm not really going to complain because you could actually trade these off. They're kind of highly desired right now, along with the Garbodor. So, yeah, I'll hang on to this for sure. I'm not going to complain about getting that at all whatsoever. All right. Dilla Bird, Snora. Ooh, double the fun. Oh my god, it's that time again. It's that time. All right, what do we got here? Oh, Lunala. I've got several of these, but still kind of lit. Move all energy from this Pokemon to your bench Pokemon in any way you like. It does like the exact same thing that the GX version does, basically. And we got. Oh, a Lion Rock GX. Oh, the regular art. Or is this a Midnight one? This is a midnight one, right? This is a right. The midnight one is the regular one. All right. Well, I already have like so many of these. I traded away one, and yeah, I got one back, I guess. So we are at three regular arts and five ultra rare so far. So as of now, we are doing pretty good here. I think we're not quite at. Have we surpassed 36? I don't think we have quite yet. No, have we? I think we have. So I guess we're doing average for a booster box pull. Hang on. Math. Math. We are currently at... No, 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 no. We're not quite at 36 yet. <laughs> We've got a while to go before we reach 24 packs left. So we're doing pretty good. We still have a good chance to go better than average. So uh, let's continue. I keep I keep calling the thing Lion Rock, Lion Rock. Sorry, I just I just want to say Lion Rock so badly because it's like I don't know I don't know I don't know what's wrong with me. It's just words, okay? Not good at that either. Another Rayquaza, okay. I wonder what these go for honestly because I have so many now. I have so freaking many. I wonder if they. I highly doubt they go for packs. Probably just some other stuff. A Jimbo Hammer, aka the Enhance Hammer. Oh, another Aqua Patch. A water energy card from your discard pile to one of your bench. I'm just now realizing that's actually kind of solid. I guess that's why people want it. And we got Hunch Grove. No, 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 no more Hunch Grows, please. 10 more damage for each damage counter on all of your opponent's Pokemon. No, no, keep that thing away. Let's attack this 30 damage to one of your opponent's Pokemon. No, 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 no. I would prefer Pangoro over Honchkrow, honestly. Like, whenever I get something bad, it's always Honchkrow. Oop, double the fun, okay. Ooh. Here's our chance. Here's our chance of victory, Bell. Oh my god, oh my god. Is it possible? Is it possible? <laughs> Secret rare, double colorless? Yeah, only in my dreams, right? Only in my dreams. Mimikyu, alright, that's cool. We've got like five now, probably more. If I can remember, like how many, how many we had before? Mallow. Why does it say? Oh yeah. It's, it's, really? I haven't gotten one of these before. Like same art? I guess not. And oh, another Lunala. Interesting. So many of these. So many Lunalas. Ugh. All right, we are on 36 packs left. 
We are counting down. Regular booster box numbers now. Gwai score. Oh, double the fun time. Uh oh. That is my second one. Okay, that's good because I did ask for more, so I'm not really going to complain about that. I'll try and make this thing work, but I highly doubt I'll be able to. And another haunch crow. Like, can these things please get out of my life? Please. Please just get out of my life. I'll be so happy. I'll be so thankful. Beware. If your opponent attacks Pokemon, 60 more damage. This thing actually really isn't that bad. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may evolve. You may draw three cards. So when you evolve it, you draw three cards. That's not even that bad. Like, I would totally rock this card. I'm going to try it out. I'm going to try it out sometime. And we got... I actually have not pulled this from the set yet. Also, Galio. I just haven't. Uh, Shining Arrow. This attack does 50 damage to one of your opponent's Pokemon. 50 for two. And Fangs of Sun. It's Fangs of the Sun. 170. Pokemon can't use Fangs of the Sun during your next turn. 170 for three is crisp. So I'm not going to complain about that, but you got to recharge. Oh, you can't use that one, but that's not that bad in my opinion. Might actually try to use that sometime. Though that is my only one of that kind. I have the GX version, but I haven't gotten that one from the set, the non-GX version yet. A double the fun. Oh boy, Heliolisk. 120 for three. This attack does 30 damage to one of your bench. That's right. I forgot about that. I think that's why I didn't like that thing. And... Oh, a full art Viva Volt. Vika, Vika Volt, sorry. That is my third one of these. I have pulled two more in the past. So, I really don't need it. <laughs> but we are at, um, so we are at three full arts and six ultra rares. I feel like we are going to end up um, evening out here to an average, an average opening. So, because uh, we're pretty close to 24 packs, I think. Yeah, we are very close. We're getting there. It's going to be another one of those average pulls. I just feel it. Unless it's going to be crazy from here on out. It's going to be one of those average pulls, I feel like. Um, all right. We got another Rayquaza. Dude, these Rayquazas, man. They just... They're just all over the place. All over the place. So many. So, so many. Another Rescue Stretcher. Can't really get enough of those. And we got another, oh boy. I'm all right with the electric one. I could rock with that. I won't complain too much. I will not complain too much. No double the fun there. Fairy. Double colorless secret rare. <laughs> oh my God, the birds. Go away birds. Passion to dance. Here's your deck for up to three basic fire Pokemon. Put them into your onto your bench. Shuffle, then shuffle your deck. Um, I'm waiting for somebody to build a deck around these birds. I'm going to try and do it too. Discard an energy from this Pokemon. If you do, discard energy from your active opponent's active Pokemon. Huh. That's interesting, I guess. Passion to dance, though. These birds are like setup cards. They're really nice. I mean, I hate seeing them, but some of them are kind of good. I don't remember what the psychic one does, and I think there's one other one. There's one for each type, isn't there? I don't I don't even know. I don't even remember. I honestly don't. I'm a fraud. Alright, Wilmer and... Oh yeah, see, here's the psychic one. I shouldn't have even said that, because now we're going to get it. Vital Dance. When you play this Pokemon from your hand onto your bench during your turn, you may search your deck for up to two basic energy cards, reveal them, and put them into your hand. Then shuffle your deck. It's good for, like, grabbing energies, I guess. Casual Slap. All right, I think, I don't know how many of those I've gotten, but I've gotten so many of the birds. Like, I'm interested to see how many I have overall. Another Aquafash. The only reason why I'm happy to get these is because, like, they seem to be trading for decent stuff. So, I will hang on to them. And another freaking Honch Crow. Ugh. Ugh. Gross. Gross. Oh, another one of those Chanseys. Thank God. This is the second one. I have to pay attention to how many I have. I think this is like the actual second one. Like I don't have any more than that. Any any more than the ones that I pulled. Oh boy, another bird. Okay, I've gotten so many of you. And oh, a full art lichen rock. Another one. I have two full arts of these now. Um, overall, but we are at 
four full arts, and seven ultra rares. All right, so we're sitting at about average for a booster box opening right now. If we can get one more GX or one more ultra rare in general before we hit 24, we will have we will have exceeded average. I still think this might end up being better than the last opening that I did on stream because I think we pulled we pulled eight or nine, I think. It was either seven, eight, or nine ultra rares out of 60 packs. Or was it 50? Was it 50? I think it was 50. No, I think it was 60. Yeah, I think it was 60. So, yeah. You know, it wasn't the best luck, but uh, it wasn't as good as past openings. But I think we could probably exceed that in this video. If we get really lucky here. Victory Bell, come on game. Don't screw me over. Don't screw me over. Don't screw me over. Give me something really good. Something really juicy. That is not really juicy. Swell. <laughs> no, thank you. Where are we at anyway? Okay, we are literally about to hit 24. Uh, we are getting pretty close. Oh boy, another double the fun. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, sweet. This is my second one. Nice. All right. I can rock with that. I can rock with that. I will not complain, which means this has to be something juicy, right? No. No. Not juicy at all. Not juicy at all, but I will not complain about this. This is nice. It's nice. <sighs> oh boy, the pressure is on. The pressure is on. Towards the end, we seem to get be getting more double the funds, but uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. Double colorless, secret rare, Rayquaza. Every single time I say I say that, it seems to be a Rayquaza. I think uh, I'm noticing a trend here. <laughs> Too many Rayquazas. All right, so we're on pack 24. So, uh, yeah, if this isn't a GX or an ultra rare, then, uh, you know, we're sitting at average. So, uh, yeah, average for at least, you know, the first 36 and it's not. So we're sitting at average. Okay. Average boys. That's fine. That's fine. Salazzle GX. Oh, I'm just kidding. Dang, man. I'm tired of seeing this because I have the GX, uh, evolution, the Como, Como, or however the heck you pronounce it. And, uh, I have so many of those, like... My first Guardians Rising opening, I got so many of those. Just so many duplicates of those things. I got one full art of it though, but dude, I was just like, I'm tired of that thing at this point. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, a Toxapex GX. I haven't got one of these before. Sick. It's a regular art. Um, I think I would prefer something else, but I think super intense poison is not that bad. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now poison. Put 10 damage counters instead of one on that Pokemon between turns. I don't think that's that terrible, but this thing does have three. Or no, it only has two evolution stages. Or technically one. So, uh, yeah, I take that back. I, I actually hope I get more of these. It's not one of the, like, the more popular GXs, but I definitely don't think it's bad. Because 100 and then poison for three... That's not that bad at all. Flip four coins. Attack is 30 damage for each heads. That's not that bad either. And total shelter GX. Prevent all effects of attacks, including damage into this Pokemon during your opponent's next turn. So, yeah, that's literally not that bad. You could, like, poison them. Oh, no, I don't know how that would work. Yeah, what you could do is you could total shelter GX the moment you send it out. And then next turn, they would probably, like, they would probably switch out. But then you could just like super intense poison or spike cannon and pretty much just kill off whatever they had. That's actually really good for getting rid of bulky, um, bulky, uh, Pokemon. If they don't have heals, at least. Assuming they don't have heals. Did I add that in? No, I didn't. So that is, uh, four regular arts. Brings us up to eight ultra rares as a whole. All right. All right. So we're still doing better than the last stream opening. So, I'm not going to complain. Udra. Better thus far. I mean, we could pull literally zero ultra rares from here on out. That would be really sad. Please don't happen. And we'd be like the exact same. Have the exact same amount of luck as last time. Aqua Patch, another one. Another Beware. And... Another one. Another bird. <sighs> the birds, man. The birds. The birds. The birds the birds man so many of these so many of these so many can i get a tapu lele gx though oh of course not oh of course another bird like whenever i ask for something it's a bird this time i'm not gonna ask for anything and see what we get
double the fun. Trevenant, not gonna complain. You already know what it is. Don't ask the gods and you get something good. That's what I'm freaking talking about. That is what I'm freaking talking about. Man, I, w <laughs> I low key wish I was streaming there so I could clip that, but I can't. I'll just have to find where it is in the video and let it rock from there on out. Yo, you already know what it is. Tapu Lele GX. Let's freaking go. That is my second one that I have. Regular art. Ain't gonna complain. That brings us up to five regular arts and nine ultra rares as a whole. It is crisp. <laughs> Now, the reason why I'm happy to get this card is because it actually goes for a decent amount. So, um, yeah. I mean, you can get a lot of packs back with this thing. So, it'd be really dope if I got another one before the ending of this. <laughs> like, I'd be so happy if I get another one or something else that I could at least trade off for more packs. But, yo. Yeah. Sick. Tapu Lele GX. Now, how many did I put on my list? That's what I want to know. I put two, so I really just need one more. <clears throat> All right, could we get one more? Like, is it possible? Is it possible to get one more? Is it legitimately possible? Could we? Will again? Okay. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Fletchender, other one of you, you just don't seem to like leave my life, huh? Just, you clingy Pokemon, you. Another god. Another one. Another goth. 15. All right, we're down to 15 left after this one. Ooh, we are counting down. We are counting down, man. Can we get a... Yo, every single time I ask, I don't get anything good. Like, it's too late. I already technically asked, so the gods aren't going to grace me. A Turtinator. That's cool. Regular Turt. Body Slam really isn't that bad. You get easy paralysis that way. <coughs> No double the funds yet. Kind of drawing the double the funds. Ain't gonna lie. Another Trevenant. Dude, I have so many of these now. <laughs> this is just insanity. I have so many. It's not even funny. I have so many. Oh my god. Oof. I think we could average out like the same amount as last opening. I think we might actually. W I think we actually will. I think it's really possible. This like. We just need one more card to be, be have a better opening than the last stream. Ah, we're not getting there though. We are not getting there. Machamp. I'm not really, I don't know. I don't have that big of a problem with this card because I don't know. I, I just don't. It's not that bad in my opinion. I think that might be my fourth one though. I don't really remember. All right, All right, Gliscor, Clefable. I got a good feeling about this card. I have a really good feeling about this card. I told you I had a good feeling about this card, bro. Yo, that delayed reaction, though. That delayed reaction. A secret rare Toxapex GX. Oh, my God. The secret rares. The secret rares. That is our first secret rare. And we are up to 10 ultra rares as a whole. Oh, my God. We finally... We broke, we broke the curse. We did it. We broke the curse, y'all. We broke the curse. Sure. I would have preferred a Tapu Lele. A <laughs> secret rare Tapu Lele. Sure, but you know what? I will rock with the secret rare tokes specs because I will actually uh, use this. So, yeah, definitely no complaints for me here. Oh my god, we actually broke the curse. I can't believe it. We actually broke the curse. And look at it, it's just beautiful. It's just beautiful. It's a beautiful card. It's a beautiful card. It's a beautiful card, beautiful Pokemon. It's amazing. It is amazing. ET is amazing. What if we get like crazy luck from here on out? That would just be. That would be absurd. Like, I would lose my mind, probably. Victini. Victory Star. Seen you a million times. I think that might actually be my fourth one. Not really sure. Or I probably have more than that. And I'm just tripping. So, you know. I don't think I've pulled a... Uh, a uh, Nine Tails GX yet. Alone in my Nine Tails GX. I don't think I have. So it would be dope if this was one of them. I don't want the card, but it would be kind of cool if I got one. Another Solgaleo. Okay, that is my third one. We can jam it. If I ever want to put this in the deck, I can actually do it now. No more, please. Because I would not run more than three. Ever. 
So no more, please. <laughs> please don't give me any more. I think we got room for, for one more GX. Can we do, can we squeeze in one more? Is it possible? Is it possible in these last eight packs? Oh, yo, my tea. I completely forgot. It's sitting over here getting cold. Talon flame. Gross. Pull all energy attached to this Pokemon into your... Wait, what? Put all energy attached to this Pokemon into your hand. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. I don't like. Search your deck for a fire energy card and attach it to this Pokemon. I don't like. Next up. Let's keep it going. My phone is like blowing up over here. It is blowing up. Another Mallow, another full art Mallow. Is it possible? Is it freaking possible? Whale Lord, gross. That is like the worst thing ever. That is the worst thing ever. Whale Lord, nast. Please don't ever make Whale Lord GX. Repent. All right. Can we extra extra break the curse? No, we cannot. Cause now we're getting birds. You know what that means. It's literally downhill from here. Last five last five packs, I should say. It has been a fun run. Oh, double the fun. Speaking of fun. Lolan Sand Slash. Okay. And we got a another Talon Flame. Ugh. Ugh. Anyway, as I was saying, it, it has been a fun run. I got a lot of stuff that I actually needed. I'm not going to lie. Like, no Como's. No Comos, no no nonsense. Basically, no Comos. No Comos, no Nine Tails GXs. Like, this is, that's the stuff that I don't want. All that other crap, I need. Like, just those two GXs are the ones that I really don't want because, in my opinion, they're just not that great. I think nobody will argue that Como is trash. Like, nobody wants Como. Like, that card is literally a waste of space. Like, you can't even get rid of it. You don't want to get rid of it because it's a really nice looking card. So you don't want to get rid of it, but at the same time, you don't want to keep it because it can't do anything for you. You're just kind of just keeping it for the looks. That's basically it. I, maybe I'll hang on to one for the looks and that'll be it. Huh, this is a different one. Have I gotten this one before? For each Pokemon in your opponent's discard pile, put one damage counter on your opponent's Pokemon in any way you like. Huh, interesting. That basically, that's basically a kind of like Garbodor's attack, Revelation Dance. Effect is nothing. Oh, okay, it's, it's the same one, just different art, I guess. Okay. I guess I'm definitely gonna mess around with those birds because I want to see like what I can come up with with those, with using those. All right, man. Can I get something good? <laughs> I don't want to ask for GX specifically, but I mean, it'd be nice to end this on end this with a bang. You know what I'm saying? Oh, not with haunt, haunch crows though. Like, please, please no, please not with haunch crows. One left, one left. <coughs> Ending with ten ultra rares as a whole isn't that bad. Like, I am fine with that. We got a good opening. We got a good start. So I really, I really cannot complain. <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen, I knew it was gonna happen, I knew it was gonna happen. Alright, so I have all the Turtonators I need, so I don't need any more of these. Up to three. Actually, I mean, four Turtonators isn't that unreasonable to run in a deck. I think it's actually fine, because people run four Laprases, so it's just like, whatever. But yeah, this is my third one, right? Yeah, this is my third one. Anyway, I've gotten all four Turtonators, which is hilarious. I haven't gotten a single regular art. Just for some Pokemon, I just get more full arts than, than regular arts. Anyway, we're up to five full arts and 11 ultra rares with one pack to go. All right, we extra, extra broke the curse. We extra, extra broke the curse. All right. It would have been tight if that was a Tapu Lele. I'm not going to lie. I would have lost my mind, but I just can't complain. I can't complain. I can't complain. You know what I'm saying? I just can't complain. What is this final card? It's always the last pack. Like, I just wish the last pack at least was godlike. Like, I wish that Turtonator was saved for the last pack. So then we could go out with a bang. But now... It's gonna be something like super average or really bad. Just watch. What I freaking tell you is a bird. We were talking about birds so much this entire opening and we ended with a bird. So I mean like, what are the odds, bro? What are the freaking odds? Anyway, that is it for this pack opening. It was fun. 
Oh man, how can I see all the new stuff that I just got? Is there a way? Is there a way? No. Oh, technically I can't look at like the new because you know, it's stuff that I already got. So yeah, this is basically the only new stuff that I got today. Toxapexes. That's about it. But anyway, that's going to do it for this pack opening, you guys. It was it was real. So we totaled out at five regular arts, five full arts, and one secret rare, and 11 ultra rares. Overall, combining that all together, it was a pretty good opening. We got a lot of good stuff. I pretty much got everything that I need. Looking at my list here, I am pretty much done with Turtonator, so I could take Turtonator off my list. Having four would be nice, but I mean, I feel like it was just kind of extra. Tapu Coco, I guess... I wanted three, right? I think I wanted three Tapu Cocos. I have three now. So I could take Tapu Coco off my list as well. Um, and we just need one more Tapu Lele. That's about it. And I have everything that I want from this set. So that is literally all that's left on my list pretty much. Um, this was a really good opening in terms of getting stuff that I needed. Like, I really needed this opening to be that solid because, like, that just helped me out a ton. You guys have no idea. It basically cleared everything that I needed off my list. Um, I do have a friend who said he was apparently going to give me some more packs because he has extra codes that he's not going to use. Maybe, maybe if I get really lucky, I can pull a top of lately from that. But otherwise, I am really happy with this opening, even though it's not like crazy luck like I've gotten in the past. But, um, it was pretty good luck-wise in terms of getting what I actually needed, not just a ton of ultra rares that are all duplicates. I got what I actually needed, so... I am actually really happy about that, but that is going to be the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please drop a like, hit a like, drop a comment, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so yet, because also before I leave, I want to let you guys know that I'm actually going to be doing um, uh, avid Pokemon TCGO content on YouTube on this channel um, in the future. It'll mostly be laddering stuff, so I'll probably do one or two laddering videos every single week, probably testing out a different deck. Um, I'm still sort of new to the game. I'm still sort of learning the ropes, sort of learning like how deck building works in this game in specific. So, you know, I'm not saying I'm godlike or anything, but if you want to see like some new deck ideas and just somebody trying to climb, climb ladder, maybe doing some tournaments every now and then when I have the tickets to do so, I have enough right now. Um, yeah, definitely subscribe if you want to see that kind of stuff. And I will be doing more pack opening videos in the future. Probably not as big, but um. I'll definitely do, be doing more, especially as the new expansion, whenever that comes out, Shadows, Burning Shadows comes out, I will be opening a ton more packs from that set, but um, yeah, and I'll probably be uploading some of my VODs from when I stream this on Twitch, um, I'll be uploading more of those VODs on the YouTube channel as well, but yeah, I guess that is it for today, so yeah, subscribe if you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in the next video, thanks for watching guys, it was a ton of fun, I will see you guys later in the next video, peace out. What the fuck you beat?